Hello, in this instructional video, we're going to be talking about your MIDI instrument again. At first, we wanted to make just simply a sound on your MIDI instrument. But now, we want to change that sound to a beautiful sound. And in band, we call a beautiful sound playing with good tone quality. Again, that is tone quality. And it's more important than anything else we do in bands. So, what we're going to do is I want you to try and recreate the sounds that I'm making on my mini instruments on yours. And I want you to try and make those sounds that you're making almost exactly the same as the ones I'm making. If you have headphones, it would be a good idea to put your headphones in whilst you're trying to match what I'm doing. We're going to start with the saxophone, and I'm going to play some whole notes for you. So here we go. One, two, try and recreate this sound. Two, here's another one, go. One, two, here's another one, go. One, two, here's the last one, go. Go ahead and replay that part of the video with your saxophone mini instrument as many times as you can until you can get that sound as perfectly close to mine as you can. Now, this is an example of a bad sound. Notice how the, um, the tone quality is inconsistent and it moves all over the place. That was not a steady sound, okay? And that's something to avoid. Overblowing or blowing too much air is also something to avoid. And overblowing can sound like this. Don't do that. Overblowing is bad. You could also underblow, which is blowing not enough air, and that'll sound like this. That's not good either. You're looking for a nice, steady sound like this. Alright, good luck, have fun, and practice, practice, practice.